Assalamu alaikum friends, my name is Muhammad and you are watching MB Detectives channel. Thanks to God, I have crossed 1000 subscribers. Thanks to all of you and welcome back to another exciting video in MBP Pump Room. I am going to give you some updates here. Uh, almost. Uh, past uh, my last video uploaded so now another updates in MVP pump room so I want I would like to give you some updates prior to our MEB, MEB equipment installation example water tank pumps as you can see here we have uh, pedestals for water tank if you have seen my last videos I have shown in that videos the construction activity for the pedestals, pumps, shuttering, steel works and how we are giving clearance, what you have to check, coordination work. There are a lot of things I have explained in my previous videos in uh, MEB pump room. So in this video I am going to give you some updates. As you can see here the water tank pedestals, the pumps and the, the room also you are uh, looking here is very clean. There is no much uh, construction activities as you can see in previous video there are some steel works there is grinding this and that so many things were going on now almost been done so as you can see now my question here now uh, put my question in front of you i will give you some update what update it is exactly here so the foundation you can see here it has been casted completed chamfered as you can see here the foundation been chamfered by looking wise it will be very nice after installation the equipment looks very good because MEP rooms are heart of the MEP services and it is heart of the building so it should be nice nice and tidy the MEP room should looks when anybody enters in the room should be looking very nice installation so the foundation looks also nice and painted neat clean td and glossy finish so as you can see here what update is here the foundation been casted everything been completed the preparation been done on the foundation after preparation preparation means they will do some grinding on that after casting the uh, foundations after casting the foundation they will do grinding on the all foundations to make any proper finishing hmm? and after proper finishing what they will do they will start their procedure of uh, epoxy paint there is a uh, sequence of uh, painting work on the foundations so you can see here so it will look glossy finishing nice td so one or two layers three layers as per their civil activities they will do the finishes in the foundation then uh, because why they are doing this to hand over to MEP after completion of civil activity in the MEP, room, MEP pump room they will hand over to MEP contractor to proceed the, their equipment installation or their all services in the MEP room so what do you think only epoxy paint on the foundation been completed and approved by consultant so we can install over equipment here so my question is this one that for example as you can see in this room they have been completed their foundation casting finishes epoxy paint done what do you think we can start over activity here if contractor forced you to do start force you to start here no start install your water tank install your pumps you start your services you can start please answer in the comment section box I want to see and all people please comment whatever comment but comment comment or write anything whatever you want to write write anything write a b c d no problem write if you write I can answer you ask questions question ask then I can answer you and this also this is also very important things here what I am explaining so I would like to see your comments in the comment box and share also with your friends, colleagues, everybody who wants to know about this MEP service installation. So guys please share, comment and like my video. So 
we cannot start. The answer is we cannot start. Even they completed the epoxy paint, they kill in and need it. No. We have to check here what other activities you will have in MEP room. For example, you have wall, you have ceiling, you have uh, floor. So, what other finishings are coming in MEP pump room from civil side? So, they must complete everything in the MEP room. They should not enter in MEP room after handing over because after handing over is our baby. We will install our MEP services all then example if they hand over you in this in this position and now you start your com you completed your things everything you install your equipment here then they came they came again enter here and they want to do their floor work they want to do the wall painting they want to do some painting on the slab what will happen on your equipment they will damage all your equipment and they after if example you install your water tank here the, there, there will be no much gap to uh, stand and uh, do paint and they cannot start uh, stand on your water tank so you must check here in uh, prior to your equipment installation you must check what other civil activities in the MLP room except this uh, epoxy paint on the foundation so they must complete for example the floor finishes is there they do some they have to do epoxy on the floor means they have to complete the epoxy on the floor if they have water uh, paint on the wall they must complete a paint on the wall they must complete if there is any slab preparation on the slab they must complete the slab preparation okay door nothing no problem door maybe they can uh, hold it we can uh, leave door but the other things to be completed like some plaster work is balanced here so they, they must complete the plaster clear on this wall also so they have to complete each and everything they have to give you any full handover the MEP room now your baby so now then we have to take this charge and then we can start our installation of our equipment so guys uh, please comment and uh, tell me your views about this video and uh, this is the update we have here and there are some i have given update as well as i have given some more information about uh, the installation prior to installation what we have to know or what we have to check here in the mep room so if, if contractor summaries if contractor force you force whatever happen but you have to care about your equipment they must take care because if you install and they damage it will be a big disaster for you you have to bring another thing and it will take time if the serious project the completion because they have you have everybody has completion date so you have to look everything and you have to take senior people advice like project manager you have to go higher management if in case if anybody forcing you to do the work so you must take care of your things here you can take decision inshallah i will give you more updates about pump room amy pump room as the work moves further and again guys please please share my content share my videos and please comment or if you would like to see more videos if any other services please comment it uh, inshallah i will try my best to upload or make that video I am moving as based on the construction activity moves here and please share, comment, like my video. Thank you very much and inshallah we will see in next video. Assalamu alaikum wa rahmatullahi wa barakatuh.